All right, time now at 516 to take a look at your weekend weather. Hi, hey Jason. Guys. Hey there, how are you? Happy Friday, man. Oh, it's a great <laughs> Friday, at least for some, if not all, because we had more sunshine today mm -hmm. than we had. We didn't even know what to do with, but things are changing quickly right now. I want to begin by showing you what radar looks like across northeast Ohio. You can see western Ohio pretty much dry right now, but our radar is down at Hopkins right now, so it's picking up on some of that reflectivity that's happening in the atmosphere, and that's because we're beginning to feature another cold front moving into the region, so a trough attached along with that is really is going to be ushering in our next weather maker, which is beginning tonight. So don't worry. Football Friday will be able to go on. We're not expecting widespread or heavy rainfall. Still, you're likely going to need that poncho as well. So I want to begin by showing you what an area in Huron County looks like right now with some light rain moving through. This is going to be a quickly moving system, even including some areas down south. New Philadelphia, Dover picking up some light rain, Hardy, Clark, and even over towards Walnut Creek, south and 77. A little bit of a, that stretch is undergoing some wet weather right now. Noticeably, you'll feel that the temperatures from 24 hours ago are a lot colder. That's because we're working in this trough that is pulling in some of these northwesterly winds right now. Area wide, our temperatures in their low 50s right now. Yesterday, we topped out at 70 degrees. So what's happening right now? So we're going to take this a big, uh, a big picture right now and really break it down for you. We have about three systems that we're watching right now. The first stack is going to be undergoing right now. You can see where that trough is moving through right now. The second act coming on Sunday. We're going to turn on the lake effect showers as well. And then by the time we get to middle of the week next week we have the third act coming in as well so let's hone in a little bit closer and take you hour by hour here in your national design mart forecast through this evening look at the winds gusting up to about 10 to 15 miles per hour some of those light showers still overspreading waking up early tomorrow morning that's when we begin to turn on the lake the lake is still about mid 50s right now so the surface temperatures are going to be flirting with near freezing by tomorrow morning Throughout the day, we climb just a little bit, still with mostly cloudy skies and also some of those westerly winds. We flirt with um, upper 30s tomorrow, so we'll have a more of a rain snow mix for tomorrow afternoon. And then by Sunday, we have even colder weather working back in, so it's going to become a snow rain mix with more areas along the snow belt, picking up some light accumulations here. I think for the most part, on elevated surfaces, some of our bridges, even our grassy surfaces, that's where we're going to see a little bit of accumulation moving back in. Union Home Mortgage seven day. Notice this Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, a bit more on the colder side. Mild weather midweek. Jay. All right. Thank you very much, Jason.